We're going to have 16 new jobs in the sawmill. There'll be 96 direct uh, construction jobs, 49 indirect jobs. You know, every job in a small community is big and uh, so much bigger than what it would be, say, in the city of Fredericton or, or whatever. But in a small community, I mean, these small communities are dying in our province. And, uh, you know, it's important for people to stand up who own businesses and uh, who employ people to, uh, you know, and tell their story and, and make people realize how important it is for every job that can come to our community and everything that can be done to make these small communities viable again. And, and for the Irvings to keep investing in our community, it's a win-win. And, 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 uh, for the whole Grand Lake region, and uh, and it's nice for a business owner like myself that I can keep employing people and and, and keep running my business and uh, know that there's going to be some security and that our community is is growing instead of instead of going backwards. And those are the things that we have to do. We have to keep on trying to uh, to make things better in these small communities and and. Uh, you know, the Irvings are helping us do that. And I think that's an important thing that they'll stand up and spend $500 million of their own money, you know, whether you're improving the pulp paper mill in St. John, you know, or building a new mill in Doketown, or enhancing our mill here in Chipman with the new stud line and, and all the things that are going on. And uh, they've stood behind our community since, I think, 61 or 63 when they first come here. And uh, they've been here ever since, and uh, if it wasn't for what the Irvings are doing in our community, there would certainly be no community. And uh, so I think, the, you know, the, the talk that I've heard is, is uh, it's, people are excited to, to see something happen and, and, uh, and to know that the mill is going to be here. There's always been talk over the years that they can just take the mill and move it out any time. And... Uh, you know, we know now that our mill is going to be here, and it's the biggest employer in our area, and, and uh, it's one that we can depend on. So.